Hey guys, welcome back to About Technology. In this video, I am going to show you how you can fix your sound or audio related problems on your Windows 11 system. So let's start. The first easy solution that I would suggest is to check this speaker icon present on your taskbar. Just click on this and make sure that you have not mistakenly muted your speaker. If you get this cross sign in front of your speaker, that means to unmute it, you simply have to click on the speaker again and your speaker is unmuted. If the speaker is mute, no matter what's the volume, sound won't come until you unmute your speaker. So in case, if no sound is coming from your speaker, first check that you have not muted your speaker. There should not be a cross sign in front of your speaker. The next method is we can go for troubleshooting. For that, you simply have to right click on the speaker icon present on the taskbar and from the displayed menu, you have to click on troubleshoot sound problems. So let's click on this troubleshoot sound problems. So it will pop up a window which would say, we are here to help. The first thing that you can do is, you can write your problem in this text box. The next thing here is, audio problem troubleshooter. It asks for your consent. It says, do we have your consent to run automatic diagnostic to try solving your audio problem. If you want to run automatic diagnostic, then simply click on yes. Now it is saying that during the scan, they have provided a sound like beep. Now do you hear that sound? If you hear that sound, then you have to click on yes. If you have not heard that beep sound, then you simply have to click on no. Now the next thing it is asking is check device driver, which means it is saying that your device driver may not be updated. So it is asking that may I automatically try to update your driver to fix the problem. So as your problem is still not resolved, you would simply click on yes and it would update the drivers. Now here it is displaying that your audio device driver has been updated, but they might have still not resolved your problem. So let's scroll down below and if you want to give a feedback then you can simply give your feedback or you can talk to your agent. So this is how you can play with the troubleshooter here. They would simply ask for your problem and step by step they will try to resolve your problem. Now the next method that I want to suggest you to fix your sound or audio related problem is using device manager. So let's open device manager window. To get the device manager window, you have to write device manager in windows search box and you can click open the app from here. Or the other thing that you can do is you simply have to right click on windows icon present on the taskbar and from the displayed menu, you have to click on device manager. So let's click on device manager. Now in the device manager window, you have to scroll down and search for sound, video and game controller section. Let's expand this section. Here, you can see that I have a Realtek audio driver for my audio devices connected to this system. You may have a different audio driver. You simply have to identify the audio driver on your device and right click on the audio driver over here. And here, you have to click on update driver. Yes, I am asking you to update your drivers because most of the time, the sound or audio related problem get resolved by simply updating the drivers. Well, Windows operating system offers you two methods to update your driver. You can go for automatic updates or you can go for manual updates. In automatic update, Windows will simply search for the drivers on internet and update your driver accordingly. And in manual updation, you have to manually search for the driver on internet, download the file on your system and you can browse the file from here and install the updated driver on your system. After updating your audio driver either automatically or manually, simply play an audio clip and check whether your sound or audio problem is resolved or not. If still your problem is not solved, simply right click on the audio driver and click on install device. Yes, you heard it right. Just uninstall the driver and when you'll restart your computer, the driver will automatically get installed on your computer. So with these many methods, you can fix sound or audio problem in your Windows 11 system. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more Windows 11 videos, please subscribe this channel, it will notify you when any new video comes out. Feel free to comment below what other new videos would you like to see in future. Hope you enjoyed this video. See you next. Bye-bye.